and say greeting to everyone here. Well, today I am Aaron Smith and I will be the MC for today event, the announcement of the winner of the speech contest and who will be receiving the certificate from this program. Well, I hope today gonna be a joyous occasion and not a heartbreaking or sad one because if you still do- doesn't win this contest, well, don't be sad. It doesn't mean that you haven't give your best yet or you don't have the skill to win. It just means that you still have a room to improve and continue to reach your potential and you can still continue to break that potential limit and reach a higher limit. It just means that, well, you haven't reached your full potential yet. So don't be sad, okay? And before that, I just want to say for everyone who win the contest, congratulations! I'm also happy for you because it means that from all of the good speech, the coach and the jury think that you are the best from all of those good speech. Just continue giving your best and continue your hard work, okay? Well, before I'm gonna choose the person who will be leading our opening prayer, I just want to say, and I hope that you will also follow me. I want to say thank, hi, hello, and your and thank you for all of the time that you spare to us. I just want to say thank you to all of the coach and teacher on this program. Thank you for everything that you have teach us and give to us. I know that all of you are a busy person in real life, so you sparing your time for us means a lot for us. I hope that you will live a long and happy life for off the coach here. And now I will choose the opening per- per- uh, the leading person who will lead our opening prayer. Uh, I'm gonna choose Maria Angelica. Hello, Maria Angelica. <clears throat> Maria. Okay, everyone. Let's pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thanks, God, of your blessed. We can meet again in the Zoom meeting. And now we will start the Zoom. Please bless us so this Zoom can run smoothly. Amen. And now we will be hearing welcoming speech from Sir Didik. Could you? Yes. Good evening, everyone. So first of all, I would like to say I'm sorry <coughs> because I am not in my room. Even that I'm the way of the place. Thanks to find my daughter. But I would like to say also thank you very much for Toastmaster International, Unaskarya Foundation, Sir Carlos Rosso, and Sir Carlos Asmar and Katya. That we are still waiting for them, actually. In this opportunity, we say thank you very much for all of the participants, coaches, and all of the persons who involved in this speech compass event. This one is a very good and great event that everyone here is the very, very best speaker. And I hope that for the future, you will be the leader of our country. This program is very good for us <coughs> to challenge yourself to be the great one. And also, for every participant here, you have already good uh, skill to speak, to analyze, or to show your idea and deliver in the speech. And for the youngster, it is not easy for for us to do this. So I hope on the next events, on the next events, we are going to meet again, especially for the coaches, especially for 
also Mom Erna, Mom Chacha, and every single participants here. And I hope that Toastmaster International will always with us, with also Yaya Santunas Karya. So congratulations on the winners. And I also say congratulations also for the participants. Although you are not the winner, but you have already been the very, very good speakers. Very, very talented for the leader of Indonesia on the future. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you, Sir Didi, for your welcoming speech. And thank you for the praise and the wish that you have to us. And I also hope that Tasmatra International and Yaya Santanaskarya will keep improving and be a bet and keep be better, better and more better in the future. And now for the next thing, we have a motivation word by the coach Carlo Brazo. Hi coach, it's your time now. Hi everyone. So happy to see you again. I do agree with Aaron. You have done great improvements in the last month. And I do ask you to make it even more improving in the future. You are so young. You have so time for you to improve your speeches. If I remember the first day I saw you last October, and I see you now, I see big differences in the way you present yourself, you present your speeches. Your speeches now are more clever, more interesting, and also more well delivered. Always remember that a speech is always composed by three parts. What you say, the way you say it, and your body language. If you succeed to put together these three elements, your speech will be memorable. So please, my friend, grow up in a good way and remember to try yourself, challenge yourself every day as you have done in the last uh, speech contest you have done, which was amazing. I am so proud of all of you. The speech to you, Mr. President. Okay, thank you, Coach Carl, for the motivational speech. We also feel honored to be teached by you. You are an amazing coach for us. And don't worry, we will Thank also you. remember of the thing yet that, that you have said, and we will keep it in our heart and continue to improve in the future. Here we are with the announcements. I have seen all your speeches. As I told you, they were amazing. And someone, everybody make a great job, but someone make an even better job than the others. So here we are. The third place, let's say the bronze medal goes to... Hmm? Ooh. Ooh. Sulia Subardi. Yeah. Sulia you make a great job. Congrats, congrats. Great speech. Great energy in your speech. Great start, great ending. Really good, really good. You can find art in the mundane and discover extraordinary in the ordinary. Photography is a universal language that transcends barriers. It enables us to communicate further and I will announce the second place let's say the silver medal we'll silver make the noise. goes to drum roll <laughs> Jocelyn Martens 
Uh, Jocelyn, great job also with you. I remember your speech in this contest, and I remember the speech in the last content. You are a great communicator. You just have to continue your pathway because you have great potential, really. Hello everyone, how are you? Have you drawn your water today? Or have you slept enough? I hope so, because today I will talk about... And now... And now... We are at the top of the winners. Because please remind that all three people are winners. And we are at the top now. So I'm proud to announce the third place. Let's say the gold medal, the big gold medal goes to oh, drum roll, Richella Banderio. Wow! Congratulations, Richella. Really Thank great. You. I remember clearly your speech, this one and the last one. Also for you, you have great potential as a communicator. You will be able to broke the monitor and arrive to the people. And that's a really, really good feature. I can barely remember what happened in my fifth grade because all I remember in fifth grade was I wake up, I shower. So all, all of you have been really, really good on your speeches. It was so difficult for me and for the other people to choose the winners, but at the end, someone should have win, <laughs> of course. So thank you to all of you. Congratulations for all of the winners and thank you Coach Carlo. Okay, now let's we hear the opinion from a random person from Juan, shall we? Okay, Prishala, can you give us the, your opinion and what do you think about this program and how what do you think about Coach Carlo and how Juan is going? For my opinions on this program, I feel like it helped me with my stage fright a whole lot because before just a few maybe a few months ago my teacher told me to participate in a school activity which uh which needed me to present a storytelling kind of story thing um and i'm pretty sure i did decent at least that's my opinion and I'm pretty sure I didn't stutter as much that I did a long time ago. And thankfully, it didn't really affect me how people were looking at my body and my face and how I was presenting it. Thankfully, they didn't really judge me all that much. And as for Coach Carlo, he helped me with my um, body language. Sort of, I kind of uh, improved, I think. I don't really know. I don't know if I have improved that much, but I'm pretty sure I've at least improved a little tiny bit. And so I'm pretty, pretty sure that this program did a whole large number on me and hopefully one of my family members which is my little brother could also join this program so he he could follow in my footsteps thank you oh okay before you done Rishala, uh let's just hear your answer for the ultimate question from the scale of one to ten how high would you rate this program is how how what? How high will you rate this program is from the scale of one to ten? 
What? Wait, my uh -huh. I'm lagging. <laughs> okay, what's the question? Sorry. Okay, so how high will you rate this program for the scale one to ten? On on what basis? When on in... the overall basis from how do you think how useful this program is? How enjoyable this program is? Well, enjoyable, 10 out of 10, because I met a lot of friends and I had a lot of fun while we were ice breaking. And for usefulness, nine, because sometimes I know, I know people would just leave and just turn off their camera and not even listen. But for the people who did actually listen, it would be very, very useful. True, true. Too bad. There are still some people who, you know, just here for the absence and never really just take what the coach say. Well, they are the one who is at the odds. And we benefit from them because, you know, uh, we could be better from them. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Uh, okay, now let's just continue the program, shall we? Uh, okay, so uh, for the next in the program, it's actually the, <coughs> the speech contest. Yeah, the speech contest announcement from G2 by Coach Keisha. Keisha. Yeah, because Mem Ketia is not already here, so I will do it. <clears throat> Well, everyone ready for G2? All the G2 members. So we'll be the winners. But I think you are the winner and you are the stars already. But we have to choose the top the three the top of three. And I will tell you about the third first. The third winner of G2 Smith's contest is going to who will be? We don't know. As the part Come on, man. Or not. Yeah, the terminal is Saina. Wait, are Saina here? Yes. The I, am. I am. Thank oh, you. Congratulations, Saina. Yes. Congratulations, Saina. Thank you. I have watched your video you are great uh, I'm, I'm even gonna draw some straws yes does it look like more a cat i mean look look i draw, I draw some stripes some cats have stripes they look cuter not my cat <laughs> the next one we have the second one in this pitch contest and the wine is already here. He is Aaron Smith, the win second winner of our team from G2. Congratulations, Aaron. Thank you, ma'am. And the back. Uh, oh, okay. So, hey, you might want to ask, Aaron, what is exactly that we need to bring in our trip today? Well, first thing first, obviously going to be a water to of this pitch contest. Yeah. He or she, come on. Mention the name. No. Albert she is already here and the first oh. winner is Stephanie Lee from Yosef Junior Senior High School. Congratulations, Stephanie. Thank you. Congratulations, yes. Stephanie. And visionaries throughout history. They were not afraid to explore the depth of their souls, to confront their inner demons, and to channel their experiences into works. And you nailed it, guys. Original. I'm a broad coordinator, actually. Thank you, Aaron. You're welcome, ma'am. Uh, oh, yeah, but okay. the so that... members oh. had... Yeah, for the members, 
even you are not the winners, but you are the winners in my heart, and we have already be the stars. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Well, I'm sure all of the G2 members already have their heart bursting and very, very nervous now, and I'm pretty sure their, their heartbeat is, I don't know, 100 beat per second. <laughs> Well, uh, okay, thank you, ma'am, for the announcement. And now let's just have the opinion from the member of the G2, shall we? Albert, I choose you. How do you think and how? what are your opinion for the coach of the G2? Hello. And how is this program overall going and how enjoyable the experience is? So for the coach, actually, I really enjoyed how they're presenting the materials and how they keep the members in touch of the Zoom so they don't get bored like doing ice breaking like table topics and stuff and pardon may I ask other stuff that you were asking like how enjoyable it is or yes yes how enjoyable it is for me it's pretty enjoyable but I think the part that is pretty um the part that is pretty it's i wouldn't say annoying but hard to hard to maintain is the time that you could attend because each of us all have like their own have their own activities also, not only Zoom. So sometimes it's pretty hard when you have an activities that you cannot leave and you also have to enter the Zoom. Okay, so same as Richelle, we want to ask you the ultimate question. How high would you rate the overall experience in this program? The enjoy the how can I say the fun level, and also how useful it is for you from the scale one to ten. For usefulness, I'll rate nine because of how it really helped me on talking to people in general. Like sometimes I still stutter a lot or like struggling to choose my next word. Like what am I going to say? Um. For the next sentence and the materials that were given to me like you should use body language and from miss katia on how to evaluate people now i know how you could encourage people better by giving more compliments if i remember correctly no oh and how and from scale one to ten how fun is it one i would rate nine also because the zooms has been pretty fun like you can hear people's stories like their experience on each pitch they delivered especially yours yours is really funny Okay, thank you. Now, you, when you say about it, I just feel embarrassed for myself because I just remember uh, how awkward it is for me to record that speech. <laughs> okay, so I kind of sense a pattern here about the most common rating is nine, or this is some sort of conspiracy, or did you guys not spill the truth? Uh, I guess you can just keep it for yourself. I mean, okay, so for the next thing is, yeah, I think everyone from G3 is very, very nervous now because they already know that their time is coming. Okay, so without delay any longer, now gonna be the speech contest announcement from G3 group by Mom Erna. Okay, hello G3, where are you? I cannot see you. Are you waiting for that or not? <laughs> are you already noted that? 
Okay, so I don't want to take your time because I know that you want to know which one the we have. Okay, let me start to call for the um, minute. I would like to start from the third place. Ah, can you guess it? Ooh. Okay, so the third place. Mm, what is it? <laughs> what is it? The no. third place. Make some noise. You get it? Make some noise. <laughs> okay, the third place. I will try to call Maria Angelica. Rauli Manalu. Wow. Yes, wait a minute. Yeah, congratulations. One of the management. But things didn't last as long as we thought. When looking for artisans to recruit new artists, I will become a victim of rot. And I can see manipulated her to. And for the second. Please, we have Michael Japtarikan. Wow. Congratulations, Michael. Congratulations, Michael. Something positive. A thing we always crave for. Some might even say that light is the best thing in this world. But what? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. And the, the first who the first is Ikesha Moril Sutiono. Wow. Is he here? Can't shine without darkness. If there were no way to distinguish happiness. You will not be happy because you will not know what it is. Whenever you are going through an unfortunate circumstance, we are you and all of the participants or member from G3. I know that they still have, they still have three more workshops. We are not yet yet. Oh yeah. We have to be patient. Yeah, we have to be patient. They we have to be patient. Work. They still have more work. Yeah, after this, yes, we still have three more workshops, but it's okay. It is okay. Good luck, then. Yeah, they can practice more and more with the best coaches that coach uh, Carlo Asmar, <clears throat> uh, sometimes Lucy, or maybe uh, Arlene. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's all uh, from G3 Aron. Back to you, MC. Thank you. Congratulations for all. Okay, Hello. my mic snap into into two different pieces. How? I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. Well, you put your camera on the right position, Michael. Yeah, good, very good. Yeah, that. Okay, so we just witnessed how Michael used his magic. Okay, and snap his mic in half i don't know how he doesn't know how to so michael on, just give your opinion well my opinion overall is that this program is actually quite good it really <clears throat> like um really improves our overall skill for public speaking but well sometimes the Participants could get bored, like myself. Sometimes when the others are explaining or maybe um, delivering their speech, I usually watch some TikToks. <laughs> and I'm oh, being honest. Okay. And I'm sure about 40 to 50% of the participants also do the same. <laughs> No, no, we, we are the same. We, we are the same. We, we are clear. 
<laughs> well, that's my opinion. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. We're gonna ask an ultimate question and an extra something on to add a little bit of spice in that. Okay. So, how high do you rate this program is from the scale 1 to 10? Nine. A solid nine. See? I know. Everyone just read it nine, bro. Okay. Well, so, so for the extra question, who do you think here often open TikTok and YouTube the most while doing this program? Just say the name. Myself. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. So Michael said that this program can be boring. So why we not let the man himself entertain us and maybe sing a song with his angelic voice? How do you guys think about that? Yeah, I yeah, I'll have to skip. I'll have to skip. I don't want to no, talk I, I don't ask you. I ask the other participant. What do you guys think? Should Michael sing as a song? <laughs> okay. If no one say yes, then I guess he is safe. No. Oh, okay. So I guess no one want to hear the Michael Angelic voice. Okay. Well, I guess we should just continue. Unless someone say yes. Come on, guys. Yeah, we can. Just... We can continue, Aaron. Yeah. <laughs> for G1. Thank you. And go around for G2. Congratulations, everyone who received the certificate. <coughs> and now we will continue to the G2 participant and member. So the one who will mm. get the certificate, so okay. let me finish the one who often get, maybe you can try the next event. And thank you for healthy time. <laughs> Frederick and Lee Junior. Saint Angelica has completed the requirement. For Albert Fasley, our president, and great MC, 
Harold Smith, congratulations. Thank you so much. Francisca, green wine. Oh, Angelica, of course. Yeah, that's all for G2. Congratulations to all the members that get certificate. Yeah, congratulations for G1 and G2. For G3, you have to wait for a while. Yeah. You have to finish three workshops more. <laughs> okay. Thank you for your effort. Then, Aaron, the time is yours. Okay, so everyone who get the certificate, congratulations to all of you. I know that this program and the journey that we've been through on this program has been kind of rough and sometimes pretty demanding. But I want to say for everyone, thank you and congratulations. You have completed the journey and has reached the ending point. And <coughs> now, because we already hear the words from the, part, uh, the participant of each group, we're gonna hear a closing speech from Mam Erna. Well. Okay, after Erna, me and then, then Mam Dada. Okay, mm, okay, okay. Man, of course. Okay, uh, thank you for this opportunity. I want to say thank you very much for everyone who has comp contributed, uh, like uh, Carlo Brusso, Carlo Asmar, Katia, Sir Didi, Mem Caca, all students. And the most important is the Naskaria Foundation. Because uh, I know that uh, all of you guys already share your time, your energy, your experience to make these activities uh, possible. Uh, these activities are very good for you. Uh, your unwavering support and commitment have been instrumental in our compliments. And then uh, together we have surpassed challenges, overcome obstacles, and I know that it can uh, make you better to be uh, to be students or maybe to be a leader in the future. Um, with gratitude in my heart, I want to say thank you so much. I hope that you can continue even you're not uh, anymore in this uh, program. I hope that you still still what still uh, want to share this experience this knowledge uh, that that what you feel what you have in this program for your <clears throat> friends or your family and people around you and like our team uh, i know that you are the star for yourself and people around you thank you good luck everyone I... wow so i will continue because we are the team. Uh, thank you for this opportunity. And actually, I'm very grateful that being um, coordinator and a nutrition coordinator for all the teachers, because <laughs> we, <laughs> I'm a pro, right? And really thank you for Toastmaster, all the coaches, Carlo Broso. Unfortunately, Mem Katia is not already here with us. And of course, our foundation, Tunas Career Foundations, they really support us. They really support all the members and also the coaches. Whatever we ask, they give us. <laughs> and also, I want to say thank you for all the effort. Thank you for your call me mind. You have to broke your ego, all the members. You manage your time. You keep the, you, you can maintain and you can manage the time that you will be already uh, Friday evening with me. I know you get bored, but you still fight to get the knowledge, you get the experience from Mem Katia and also me. <clears throat> and then I hope the program will grow up and becomes the best program is our foundations. 
and also especially for our CEO, actually, Mr. Edric. Unfortunately, he is not only here also. And to whoever the organizer will be there, keep fighting. Thank you for the themes. Thank you for the times. You are great. You are the stars. Okay, thank you, Ma'am Erna and Ma'am Chacha for the closing speech. And once again, I want to say all of the students, I will repress, I will represent all of the students here. And we will I'll once again want to say thank you for, for, for the Toastmaster International and for the Tunas Karya Foundation to get, that give us the opportunity to join this program. And when, we will also want to thank you because we benefit a lot from this program. And now we already reached the end of this event. And now I will choose Alfie Tan to lead the closing player to end this event. Alfie yeah. Tan? Yes. Could you lead the you... closing player? Can you hear me? Yes. yes. Oh, okay. Friend, let's pray together. God, thank you to bless us till the end of the Zoom. Hope uh, we all us get healthy. And thank you for bless us. Amen. Amen. Well, thank you guys. Okay. <laughs>